Yeah, and so we're uh, in the pit box and uh, got some new faces here as ever for the CTCRC. One of them, Johnny Kent, and uh, first ever set of racers, uh, pre-66 and pre-83 uh, in the Mini. How's it going? Quite terrifying, actually, to be quite honest with you, but good fun. Yeah, it is terrifying. Now. So... <laughs> Of course, yours is a pre-66 car, but uh, pre-83 as well, um, just to kind of get the signatures, I understand. Uh, how was it out there with the uh, the younger guys, I guess, or the younger cars? Oh, the young, oh yes, they're, 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 they're useless, really. The little mini round this last corner had a lot of traction compared with the, uh, the these big rear-wheel drive things. We've got Mr. Donnelly behind here, look, being very annoying, trying to, um, trying to, trying to put everyone off. And I mean, obviously, you know, racing is something that a lot of car enthusiasts like to do. When did you realise, you know, one day I do want to race? And uh, how long has it taken you to get to this point? I think it was when I turned 50 and it was a midlife crisis. Right. Suddenly I had to do something with my life that wasn't work, work, work and doing the same boring old stuff. I've always been a petrol head, so I decided to give it a go. Went out in November for my first ever track day. And... Um, it was quite terrifying. I was put in touch with uh, Martin Donnelly, who's been kindly giving me uh, lessons and screaming at me as I get things wrong. We <laughs> go around Paddock at Brands Hatch, and we span, and we had Porsches and various things screaming towards us sideways. And we're sitting in a little blue, little red mini at the time. Um, so a lot of lessons have been learnt, but um, yeah, it's great fun. It's a lovely, nice, nice feeling. Very friendly people around here. Really like it. You in for the whole season? Yeah, yeah, well, I've got to get my signatures first, but yes, I'm trying to yeah, do the lot. Yeah. Absolutely, Len. Well, let's hope that the uh, weather dries out. Uh, I have my doubts, personally. Um, and uh, I look forward to seeing you back out there on track. See a real professional action.